everyone, it's me, Alex, and everyone's favourite Instagram star, Mikan Mandarin! Why, thank you so much for having me! So today we're sitting in a little karaoke booth in Tokyo. Sort of a little bit tired after a day of thrift shopping, a day of eating fried chicken. Uh, what else did we do? <gasps> Pokemon Center. Yeah, but not to mention it's rainy, and I feel like when it rains, you just get a little bit tired. Yeah, a little bit tired and sleepy. Yeah. So we've sat down with some pepper shi. Uh, we're <laughs> going to <laughs> <laughs> we're going to uh, rejuvenate ourselves with some caffeine and some hardcore Britney Spears. I, I do a really good Britney Spears. <laughs> It's I'm like quaking already. Yeah. I, I, I do a good Britney too. Do so. you? Oh my gosh, we can do a Britney challenge. A <laughs> but speaking of challenges, we were sitting here having a discussion, feeling competitive. We decided we're going to do a Daiso challenge because who doesn't love Daiso? Who doesn't come to Japan and go nuts in Daiso? So we're going to give ourselves a hundred dollar budget. So we have to spend a hundred dollars between the two of us. So it's a humble fifty dollars each and. Uh, as Mikan pointed out to me, that's like 50 items because the things are a hundred Because you were saying like, let's do like $100 each and I'm like, are you kidding me? Because everything is 100 yen Relax. each. Relax. <laughs> so there's like a hundred items, like I live in such a small apartment. I would like two suitcases. Where am I going to put these yeah. things? So we're going to do a modest $50 each, which is still going to be a lot. Yeah, that's going to be so much. We don't have to spend the full $50, that's the thing. Yeah, but if, you, if, if we want to win. If you, I think you're trying to like convince me to not spend the full 50 Yeah, so I mean, you don't need to spend $50, it's <laughs> fine. You don't need to. And then Alex just goes like full out. Like. <laughs> I'm thinking we're going to buy things like um, home decor, you know, like pillows, decorations, things like that. Maybe some makeup, maybe some stationery, but I don't want to give too much away because we are nemesis right now. Yeah, I, don't want, I do not want to be telling her what I'm getting because I have some secrets up my sleeves. We are going to separate after today and Mikan's going to do her shopping and the video will be over on her channel. So I need you guys to go over to the link in my bio and check out her video where she'll show you guys what she ended up buying. And if you keep watching this video here, you'll see what I ended up buying. And then we want you guys to vote. So we'll do like a little poll or something, maybe on Instagram, or we might just leave it in the comments and be like, tell us who, who did the better shop, who got, you know, better value, or who got better items or whatever. But we don't, what's the judging criteria? How do we, I, I just feel like people can watch, people can see what they got and be like, you know what, I relate more to the person ah. who bought these items and you know, there's not really a strict criteria, just okay. like whatever you ended up okay. liking or there you go, that's, that's a good way of putting it. <laughs> I'm nervous because this is the queen of cute right here. This is the queen of halls. <laughs> <laughs> good at spending money, maybe like, not so good at like choosing the items. But, no, but, but <laughs> you have such great taste as well, so oh, like, you. the competition's off. Okay, the competition is on, so it's don't forget really to head on. over to Mikan's channel. Okay, so that's okay. all for the karaoke room before I spill my drink all over myself. Check out Mikan's channel. The link is in the description below for her video. So I hope you guys enjoy and please let us know who you think won the challenge. See you in Daiso. Bye! Okay, Mikan, I'm here. I'm ready. I have my $50 budget and I am going to beat you for sure. I hope, maybe not, because You've been in Japan a lot longer than me and you probably know all of the secrets, but I'll give it my best try, so let's go! So I'm looking for the best of the best. Like, you know, this, I, I saw this, my first thing that I saw, and yes, it's cute, it's a cute candy fan, but also, is it the best of the best? Because I definitely want to win. Do you think this is winning material? No. Okay. <laughs> buy drinks. I'm so tempted to buy cute drinks, but no. <gasps> Pastel Crocs? No. No? This is a cute fan. Okay, that's cute. Oh, swim time. Pokemon, Pokemon, Pokemon. Pokemon curry. Surely that's, that's winning material, right? No, I feel like to save budget, I should only get one. I think it's curry sauce. I think I've got to get the one with Evie on it. Okay, got to stop buying food. Food is not, I mean, yeah, but I could spend $50 on food and I feel like my audience would vote for me to win, right? Vote one for the pretty pastel party. Mikan loves food. She does <laughs> love food. She particularly likes fried chicken. There's we no should fried find something chicken. fried chicken. Yeah, something fried chicken. Look at all these snacks, guys. Oh my God, they're the most beautiful snacks ever. So many snacks. And this snack right here. <laughs> Literally, it says awesome. I should get. <gasps> Look! Oh, okay, that's sick. Oh, the Disney molds. 
That's cute. Okay, we should keep that in mind. I think there's more levels. That's so iconically Japanese. I feel like I should. Maybe like a piece of tuna or tamago. No, onigiri. Onigiri's way cuter. Yeah. Okay, they have bunnies on them. That's adorable. Coin purses. You know what? I'm not, I'm not overwhelmed. I feel like kind of underwhelmed. It seems like a very small Daiso. I feel like Mikan tricked me. She was like, oh, this one in Harajuku. You just said that because you knew it was small and it didn't have a very big range. I know what you, I know what you're up to. Okay, I take back what I just said. Mikan wasn't lying to me. <laughs> oh, now we're talking. Okay. It's a little crescent moonlight. Oh, my Melody toothbrush case. Okay. I think my game plan is I'll circle around the outside and then go through the aisles. Oh, no. This is pretty. I love that. Yes, most excellent. All these bags on my shoulders so heavy. I feel like Mikan's gonna be at an advantage because she won't be uh, burdened by 100 kilos of shopping. Oh, look, there's purses. Little coin purse, ice cream coin purse. Cute. And cute. Do you think that's good enough? Is that good enough to beat her? Are you? Oh, they're squishy. Oh my god. Flutty poo. Flutty poo. Surely this is winner's material, right? Yes. <laughs> what are those like squishy? They're literally, I think they're just like literally for, for squishing for no other purpose. <laughs> this scratch rainbow paper sheets. Oh my god. I'll, I'll get this and I'll put vote one pretty pastel, please. <laughs> Take that back. That that is cute. Look, that's a photo album, but all my pictures are digital, so maybe not. Make your own path. Love yourself. Oh, that's no. Oh, no. I feel like I should get makeup. Look, what compressed facial mask. That's kind of cool. It's like a little tablet. And I think you just put... Okay, that's sick. <laughs> I'm at a disadvantage. <laughs> There's a little ponytail thing. <gasps> oh, cute pony. Oh, if you get two, you can put them on either side of your, you know, buns. Okay, I feel like I should get a couple of different colors. Even look, look at that. Oh, little strawberries, look. Oh, that's so cute. What are... Oh, look at those. Okay. Mm. Yes. I saw a kid with those the other day Did and you? I was like, I want those. Now you're going to see an adult with them. <laughs> These Hello Kitty under eye masks. <laughs> yes. That's really cute. It's adorable. I like that. Nail. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Would eyebrow know, mascara be considered one. cool? Do you think? No. Okay. Okay. We're looking for unique things, right? Yes. Unique finds. Correct. Oh, that's pretty. Do you remember? So when we were in, um, Shibuya 109, we were looking at pearl hair clips and they were like $8 each. This is $1.80 or something like that, so that's a guess. Oh look, don't snap clip pastel. It says, it literally says pastel, so it's illegal if I don't buy it. <laughs> Unicorns! Unicorns! Oh my gosh, these mirrors are, oh look at that one! It's like perfume. Oh that's really cool. Do your best. I'm glad that this mirror is encouraging me in this competition. <laughs> Just do your best. Card or file? Card file. Good time a card file. That's really cool. You've definitely hit fifty dollars. No. Yeah. You, you really think? Show me your basket. Yeah, oh, I reckon. No. Okay. Well, um, what are you? Ink pad. Good time ink pad. Alex, what are you gonna do with an ink pad? I don't know. Well. Write a letter to the king and seal it with ink. <laughs> Look, you can like put your earrings and your jewelry in there. That's epic. Okay, I love that. And she's got a purple bow, so she's even cuter. Oh, Tiasha, look! <gasps> there we go. What are they? That's oh, the money. Like, that's the, are they buttons? Oh. <gasps> Good atomic oh buttons! <laughs> okay. Wait, there's Hello Kitty ones and my <gasps> Melody ones too. Oh, oh shit. Bare measuring tape. That's so cute. But I probably don't need it. No. Oh look, felt animals. That's sick. Shinkansen patch. <gasps> that's absolutely a must. Shink. That, you reckon that's a must? 
That's I a must. love that. That's okay. a must. Also, okay. can you put one in there for me? Okay. <laughs> Man, I feel like this would be extremely challenging, but I totally want to give it a try. Look, it's a little cockatiel in a nest, but I have absolutely no idea how you're supposed to. Show me the front again. How cute is that? Oh, well, that's sick. But I wouldn't know how to use it. <laughs> that could be a fun that challenge. That work, though. yeah. It could be a DIY video, but I'm on a limited budget. <laughs> Hello Kitty makeup here. Oh, I want every shade. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, eyeshadow. Oh my god, I'm gonna blow the budget so bad. Okay, what if I just buy the stuff for myself and then do like a separate video with for the $50 challenge and then get everything else that I want? Yes. There's oh. no one stopping you, Alex. No one except my, <laughs> my bank account. <laughs> That's adorable. I love that. Because I think I've already blown the budget. <laughs> And I'll have to start culling. I'll see Bob White Ben. Ah, no, no. Yes. I quite like it actually. Okay, cool. <laughs> That's all I need. But you need a cull. You need a cull. <laughs> I said no to half the stuff in your basket. <laughs> That's me every time I go online shopping. I said half <laughs> half the stuff I said no to, but I got it anyway. Mmm. Oh, <gasps> Shiba. Mm. Shiba. Oh, that's really cute. I feel like I do need to get a notebook, right? Surely. A notebook's pen. best of the best. Okay. Um. Is that a shit concept pen? Yes. Okay, that's cool, but it's it's not contest worthy. <laughs> it has an LED light built in it. You're joking, what? Rainbow lightning. Rainbow light. Oh, okay. okay. Hmm. No, no, no. You're crazy. <laughs> Wait, is that, would that have been the, the, the winning? For me. <laughs> <laughs> this one more level. You, oh, I'm stressed out already. <laughs> oh my God. I'm gagged. I'm literally gagged. <laughs> what is it? It's a cockatiel coin purse. <laughs> <laughs> Kamomiru. Kamomiru no kaori. <laughs> this is a chamomile. Pikachu bath bomb. And he's even shaped like a Pikachu. <gasps> Lush has nothing on Daiso. <laughs> Socks. Socks. <laughs> okay, none of these are super cute. None of them. I'm disappointed. There's, I don't see an animal anywhere. Oh, there's one. There's an animal. Uh, flamingos. Yeah. Oh, those are cute. Little heart, little hearts. Look at the love hearts. That's cute, but it's not, mm. not good enough. We are now on the third floor. Oh, I see what you see. Look at the penguin. He's so cute. Polar bear. Look at the rainbow dragon. Oh, oh my god. Me. Oh, they're a thousand yen though. Yeah. <coughs> Jerry? Cockatiel? Budgie? Or parakeet, as they call them here. Well, they call them in America, parakeets. And then there's also a blue parakeet. Blue budgie. Oh my god, this is like almost a hundred dollars worth of stuff. No, it's not. Surely not. I bet you a hundred dollars. Bet me the contest. <laughs> <laughs> These are so cute. That is like the cutest silicon mold I've ever seen. <laughs> okay, yes. Oh, should I get? I'll have to get the pink one. The pink's definitely cuter, even though they're exactly the same. Yes, done. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, that's abs. Oh no, it's wrapping paper. Oh, so you put your onigiri on it and then you fold it up. Okay, that sounds. That seems like a lot of effort. And I don't really eat onigiri. But the problem is I don't know exactly how much they are. Is it 108 yen? Is it? Doesn't actually. Nothing has a price on it because it's all the same price. But if you base it off the fact that it's like 100 yen each, that would be 50 items. 108 yen. I say round down. I don't think meat cut minds. If okay. you just say everything's a hundred yen, okay, right? So fuck it, son. Okay. One, two. 
one hour later. 35, 36. There's 36 things. So if it's 100 and, let's say it's 108 times, that's only 3,888. Shit. So wait, how many more things? 12 more things. Although as I was pulling some things out just then, I was like, do I really need a giant squishy poo? Um, that's like the one thing that you did right today. I got this. I got this in the bag or in the basket. That's really cute. Yeah, I think I should definitely get the Gouda Tama milk clip because I drink lactose-free milk and it's in a carton and it always goes stinky, so that's perfect. Bottle cup? Yeah, I have this. I bought it last year. Wow. I've never used it once. Oh, <laughs> it looks handy. It's, it's very cute, but not that practical. Mm. Back down. Okay, I think the floor beneath us was the perfect floor. Mm. Mm. I almost feel satisfied with what I've bought and too tired to continue. Well, maybe the UV thing would be cool. No, but there's no UV light here, so I wouldn't be able to use it, so it wouldn't count. Care case. Oh, that's adorable. That's going in for sure. How did I miss that the first time? And there's Hello Kitty hair clips. Oh wait, no, that's not hair clips. I thought that was hair clips. It's little little pitchforks. Look at this, this is like a felt box. Yeah. A good Atama felt box like folds out into this box like that. Oh, that's awesome. I feel like that would be good. Surely that can't be 100 yen though. Is that the little twin stars one? No, no. Still Hi. thinking about the resin? Yeah, see my concern is because I don't have the light. It's like, well, you, she can't use it. And I feel like it doesn't count in that case. <laughs> if you have 12 more items, you can get the whole Hello Kitty set. I could set. literally get the whole Hello Kitty collection for that. But maybe I'll just get, this is eyeshadow. I could get eyeshadow. Are you sure those are 100 yen? I don't know, it seems too good to be true. But it, it says it would be marked if it wasn't, so. Mmm, I'm so torn. Ugh. Existential crisis. Oh my god. Look, look, it's a little bird disguised as a rabbit. Oh. Okay, I feel, my soul feels complete now. Look, belts. Oh, the belts are 500 yen. But it fits in the budget, but they're not that cool. Sticker flakes. Oh, that's cute. That's, look at those stickers. Wow, they're adorable. Oh, these are all Ziploc bags. Oh my God. Mm. Zip, pizza Ziploc bag. Oh, that's, that's tempting. But what, what am I gonna put in that? My nail peelies. I'm so disappointed by this notepad selection. Like a couple of years ago when I came, there were pink glittery notepads and all sorts of things in Daiso. So I feel a little bit ripped off. <laughs> But also I feel like I have to get one because I bought a pen. It makes sense to buy something to write on. Right. <laughs> I think we can give up. I think, I think I've done enough. Maybe I'll get extra points because I didn't spend the budget. I'll be like, look, I got all of this for only $35. Beat that, Mikan. Okay, I am going for the cat body milk because that's such cute packaging. It's really satisfying to hold. <laughs> You have Quite to take these snacks. all back though. Ah, uh, yeah, true. Tripping over baskets of food. These all look really nice. Oh, what's down here? Hello. That one is so tasty. Oh, look, little birdie. No. No, I don't think I need, I don't need to, it's fine. They always get you at the checkout. Right there, I see Hello Kitty lollies. <laughs> Candy, fresh candy. Yes, sold. Oh, these are cute too. Do you look how That's adorable. Whoa, Kiki and Lala. Okay, this will fill out the budget nicely. Oh, no. No, I shouldn't get too much food. Are these soft? No, they're hard. Oh, no, they're hard. Just incredibly stressful packaging. That makes me not want to eat this. Oh my god, look at this guy. That is not appetizing. <laughs> Everything's 108 yen. Okay. Mm -hmm. One week later. Yeah. 
You did such a good job. We are the champions, my friends. You know, in Australian conversion, that's probably 50 bucks. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> I've got my uh, receipts. 4,536 yen. What can I say? I'm the pastel dollar store queen. <laughs> A brief update. We're actually at uh, Narita, which is where the airport is, and there's a Daiso here. And I figured, well, there's still $5 left in the budget, so I'm gonna see if I can grab a couple of things that might help to push me over the, the winning finish line. And look, what is that? What is that I see? Are they pastel toys? Is that, is that? Oh, tatsumo kawaii desu. Ikura desu ka? 500 yen. 500 yen. <laughs> Oh, it's really cute. It's really cute. <laughs> Do you think this could help me win? Although, where am I gonna put this? Wait, let's let's see the rest of the sofa. Okay, I gotta see, I gotta look around first. Yeah. I think I think we're onto a winner here. Chair leg foot covers so that your chairs don't scratch the floor. Look, Shiba version. Shiba version. Oh, that's so cute. Oh. Or Shiba Inu wearing a bow tie. This is a stretchy knit bottle holder. Shiba Inu with a bow tie. Shiba Inu with a bow tie. And I'm back. Yay! Hello. Skin. Oh, yay! <laughs> okay, so let's have a look at what I bought. I'm so excited because this stuff is literally too cute. I think I, I think I completely nailed the brief. I don't see how anyone could possibly pick any better items than what I chose because I think that this is like the, the creme de la creme. Uh, I don't know what the equivalent of that word would be in Japanese. Maybe the wasabi to my soy sauce, I don't know. But anyway, let's jump straight into it. And I'm gonna start off with lollies because I need that sugar. So we have fresh candy and it's got Hello Kitty on it. Anything that's Hello Kitty themed is an instant win from me. Here we have apple, lemon and grape flavor and they're hard candy. I am more of a gummy girl myself, but let's see. Okay, we got a little purple one. What's in there? They're like little stars. You're just gonna have to take my word on this one. This is delicious. I don't know whether it tastes more delicious because it's got Hello Kitty on it or what, but it's really, really nice. I went straight for the grape flavor because let's be honest, there is no other flavor that matters. Some more food that uh, I can't quite try right now. This is the Pokemon curry. This has Pikachu, Eevee, and Rowlet on the front. It looks like it's one sachet in this box and uh, you can heat the sachet in the microwave and then I guess you just pour it over the top of your rice. Pokemon themed food for the win. Perhaps I should do I only ate Pokemon themed food for a week. That's uh, definitely a surefire way to get diabetes probably because most of it's candy. Speaking of Pokemon food, do not confuse this with Pokemon food. This is in fact, I believe, a bath bomb. I'm going to assume that this isn't a giant Pikachu shaped Baraka tablet and say that this is indeed for the bath. I also picked up this cute little silicon mold that's got cats sorry, and paw prints on it. Do you like it? I'm gonna use it for ice cubes today. <laughs> Something completely random that I bought is this pink poop, which, um... Holy sh! quite literally. The holiest of sh! Oh my god, it smells like... It smells like white chocolate Kit Kats. Ah! <laughs> It is not a satisfying squish, unfortunately. It's not slow rising. I picked up some stationery because who doesn't love a little bit of Japanese stationery? I've got this cute little pencil case that says Fluffy Friends. It's got a hedgehog on it. And to put within it, I have, this was a two piece set. This is just two pink pens that have black, blue, and red on them. They're very, very comfortable, easy to write with. And on the side, it says pink of the pink. Do you want to hold one of those? I also got this, which is a, uh, a fluffy pom-pom on the cap of this pen. And I really love that this is a very, very skinny pen. It makes it super easy for me to write with. I know everyone has a different preference, but I really like this one for writing with. I love that you can distract people with it. You can distract your birds. You can distract your kids. Innocent fun for the whole family. Please don't freak out. This is gross, but in the most Japanese stationary way possible. This is a, a piece of meat notepad. 
and it even came in a little black tray that's supposed to make it look exactly like a piece of meat. Yeah, that, that's a that's a steak, Archie. I don't know if they're sticky notes, I believe that they are. Oh no, it's not sticky notes, it's literally just a notepad that you can flip through and tear off. Uh, a perfect way for me to test out my pens. More in terms of stationery, I got the most adorable stickers you've ever seen. These are bird stickers. Unfortunately, no eclectus parrots, they are only cockatiels and budgies, but they are so adorable. I also got some little nail art decals. Now, I'm not entirely sure how to use these. Oh, here we go, there's English instructions. Polish your nail, stick your favorite sticker, press it with your finger, finish with top coat. Well, that's easy enough. This is one of my favorite purchases. This is so cute. This is a Gudetama card holder. It feels really, really nice. It's like really hefty and doesn't feel like it was only a dollar. It's basically got a whole bunch of little sleeves for your cards. So I don't like to keep credit cards in these sort of things because I have been skimmed in the past where someone's, you know, passed one of those machines over my purse and managed to pay pass money off me. So I only keep things like loyalty cards in these or bus passes, things like that. This little Twin Stars case is so adorable. I have to figure out... You know, that's it's not for you. I have to figure out what I'm going to use this for, but it's super, super cute. In keeping with the Sanrio theme, I've got these buttons. These are adorable. There's three Hello Kitty heads and three little Gudetamas. They have just a little ring on the back so you can attach them to things. I'm even very, very tempted to remove the buttons that are on this cardigan. I feel like I could so easily go and replace some of the buttons on some of my boring clothes with these Sanrio buttons. Not for you. Not for you. Let's have a look at some of the accessories that I got because these are mind-blowing if I don't say so myself. I have three of these cute little hair sort of pom-pom balls, three different types. Yes. So the combination of pink, yellow and purple and then there's two that are blue and green. These are the ones for me and are those the ones for you because it's green? It's been a little while since I wore my hair like a child in ponytails. How did I used to do this? I guess I'd part my hair in the center and then we take one half of it. I also got some more dangly ones like this. These are super cute because these are filled with little beads. They kind of look like little lollies. I also picked up this one that has like iridescent love hearts in it. This one's so adorable. It's really simple. I wish that I'd picked up a second one. I don't know why I only got one. I also got these. These are so adorable. These are just little hair clips that have pearls on them. Pearls and little diamantes. Now, I'm not entirely sure where on your head you're supposed to wear them. Like, are you supposed to wear them on the side or are you supposed to... I mean, I guess you can put them anywhere, right? I mean, there's, there's no stopping you putting it anywhere on your head. Nice. I also got these. These are, what do you call these? Snap clips. They are pastel snap clips. I've been looking for things like this everywhere in Australia and I just can't find them. Can you please desist? Desist! Ah! Shh, don't be mad. Snap, snap, snap. No, no, no shark attack. And I also got this one. Now this is a, like a circle clip that's on the end of a tie. So I guess that you use the tie to secure it to your hair when you put up a ponytail. Like this, I guess, you would do it. And then you use the clip itself, which opens, and you wrap it around and it hides the hair tie. How cool is that? This is, this is the future. This is the future. Hmm, may as well put this one in too. That's all the hair accessories that I got. I also got, I got the most adorable socks ever. This is a cockatiel disguised as a rabbit. And it's got rabbit, question mark. No, 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 please, no attack. No. Look at the socks. The cockatiel is disguised as a rabbit, which is so incredibly adorable. I really hope these fit because I love them. <laughs> So these are the type of socks that are supposed to be worn with like Mary Janes. They're a little bit small, but I'm gonna deal with it. I also picked up this. This is a fan that's shaped like paddle pops, <laughs> which is great because it's getting very warm in here. 
Is it wings? Do you like it? It's like we're flying, Archie. We're soaring. Beast! 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 <laughs> kind of. Ha ha! Hello Kitty. These are so cool. These are Hello Kitty eye patches. No. 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 Let me be a weeb in peace. So they're very, very soft to the touch. They have Hello Kitty all over them and little bows everywhere too. Keeping in theme with Hello Kitty, I got these Hello Kitty makeup wipes. This one says, she'll dress you up in style. Hello Kitty, you can never have enough red or ribbons in your life. Do they smell? They smell like menthol. <laughs> Literally smells like men <coughs> menthol mints. <laughs> Archie's not gonna like this one. <coughs> this is body milk with cat. So uh, this is an adorable looking package. It's so cute. It's literally just body lotion, but it's it's got a cat face on it. Are those eyes looking at you? Are they looking at you? Now I wonder what it smells like because I didn't get to try it in the shop. It smells awful. No. Oh, I mean, it, it smells like eucalyptus. If you're Australian, you'll know what eucalyptus is. But the packaging's very, very cute, right? Now, more cats. Sorry, sorry to completely ruin your day. This is a Hello Kitty jewelry box. So when you open it up, it's got some foam and you're meant to be able to pop your rings and various things like that in there. Or your bird. You can keep him in there too. The Hello Kitty with a purple bow. How could I say no? Wow, I just realized I look like every single white girl after her first trip to Japan. Next up I have a few items that Archie is going to be so excited about. You're gonna love these, I promise. So first up is the most... Okay, maybe not. I thought he'd like it. Uh, I don't think he does. It, it's an adorable coin purse that looks like a cockatiel. I really thought you'd like that, but... The... Look. Friends? This is a squishy silicon coin purse and it's so adorable. They love cockatiels in Japan. They just, I don't know why. I mean, I love cockatiels too, but in Japan, you can get cockatiel themed things everywhere. This coin purse is so cute. I have that many silicon cat coin purses lying around, but never in Australia would you find a bird themed purse. So I'm very, very happy about that. And to continue on with the bird theme, we have three very exciting things. Thing number one, cockatiel mug. So this adorable mug has it's a happy day written on the back with these three super cute cockatiels. And on the front, this cockatiel's whistling. It's so sweet. Mug number two, we have a green one. Ah oh yes, this is your one. So we have mother's mug and baby's mug. So this one has a little budgie that says tweet tweet and on the back it's also got it's a happy day. I know it's not quite an eclectus parrot, but it's about as close as we're gonna get. Look! And then the third one, we have a little blue budgie. What do you think of her? We don't like her as much as the green boy. These are the cutest mugs in the world. There's no way that I could resist them. I could have just got one, but I was like, why would I only get one when there's other designs to be had? So now we have an adorable little collection where can be Daniel can have the blue one, I can have the yellow cockatiel, and Archie can have the little budgie. It's a little set of family mugs. Now I also got this. This is a complete dead opposite to how cute all of that was. This isn't cute or interesting at all. I mean, it is interesting. These are called compressed face masks. Never seen anything like this. I think I'm gonna have to go into the bathroom and, what does it say? How to use wash, Ow. wash your face, apply enough lotion to the mask for it to swell up. Lotion. Open the wet mask carefully and place it all over your face. Wait for 10 minutes, then remove the mask. What lotion? I thought you would just, like, put it in water, so I'll have to go into the bathroom and test that out. I also got this. 
This is Hello Kitty lipstick. This is just the cutest packaging ever. I don't know if it's got any pigmentation to it. Kind of. The last four items. Okay, so we have a, a little onigiri. This is a keychain. I love food themed keychains. So this was definitely a win. I also got this. This is just a very simple, like a clear resin love heart with some iridescent glitter on the inside. I got this. This is a Gudetama ink pad. I have no idea what I'm going to use this for. I'll see if I can find something to stamp into it, but the packaging was just so cute. It's a, a great thing to add to your stationery collection. Oh, and last but not least, this is a little milk clip. This is a Gudetama milk clip, so it's supposed to help you clip shut your milk cartons. I also got this Shinkansen patch. This is an iron-on patch that's got a smiling Shinkansen on it, which I just thought was so, so, so cute. And this is gonna go straight on a denim jacket. So that's it, guys. That's everything. Let me know down below how you think that I did. That was $50 that got me all that adorable stuff. Don't forget to head over to Mikan's channel because she spent the other half of the $50. I don't know whether she would have bought any of the same stuff that I did or if she put her own unique spin on it. I'm really excited. I haven't seen what she got yet. We're going to upload our videos at the same time and then I'll see hers and I'll either be quaking in my boots or I'll be like, yeah, sorry, I smashed it. I smashed you. I don't think I will be able to claim that title because Mika lives in Japan and she has a lot of Daisos at her disposal. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. Click the notification bell. Follow me on Instagram. It's pretty pastel, please. So with that, thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Mwah!